Welcome to Inside Science TV. Depending who you talk to, everybody has their own reason why the flu hits most in the winter. I think it would be just the opposite, that it, there would be uh, less flu in the wintertime because it would be killed off by uh, the colder weather. Now, atmospheric scientist Lindsay Marr and virologist Elan Kumaran Subaya have teamed up to show it's not the cold weather on its own that creates a spike in flu cases. It's not the cold outside, but we think it has to do with how well the virus survives in air, indoors. In the study, researchers in a lab added live flu virus to human mucus and other samples, then exposed them to air with different levels of humidity. They found the flu kept its infectious ability best in humidity levels below 50% or over 98%. So if you cough or sneeze, the virus survives better when the conditions are very dry, when the humidity is very low. Mucus droplets from a sneeze or cough totally evaporate in dry, less humid environments, leaving infectious flu virus to float in the air where more people can be exposed. Cranking the heat at home or at work creates the dry, less humid conditions that are perfect for the flu. So how can you help keep the flu away? So you keep the humidity at 50 to 60 percent and um, try to uh, drink a lot of fluids during winter dehydrate and not getting dehydrated, rehydrate yourself. Experts also say get a flu shot. Science helping you stay healthy every winter. I'm Josh Lebowitz reporting. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.